What's up guys? Welcome back to our channel. Another It's So Facts will be added today in our learnings. Last week's episode, we learned about intellectual property. And for today's episode naman, we will give you ideas on how to keep things which are rightfully yours. That is right boys, because today we'll be discussing about copyright. And speaking of copyright, why pick up line kasi mo L? Woo! naman ta. Siyempre. Sana copyright ka na long. Bakit? Para akin ka na lang sana from the moment of your creation. Wow! Mm -hmm. Ay. Okay now? Okay. 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 Yes. To know more about copyright, here is Miss Marian T. Debit to explain to us further its function and benefits. Let's, Let's all watch, watch this! this. Copyright. All right, so um, in cover, it's pretty simple. You just have to get a form from me or download it from our website. It's just a two-page form. Um, the first page contains your register, uh, your data as an applicant and as a as, a, as the writer. The second page should be notarized. And then you attach. We now do not encourage for you to print out like print out your book. We encourage you to save it in a like for example a CD or a flash, drive. flash drive or yeah and that's it so there's only four four sets of forms and two sets of actual work for copyright and the fees the fees uh, for small entity for for students like you you will be paying only 560 pesos for the copyright deposit here in the region but when you deposit in the in our head office it's 200 pesos What's the difference between a trademark and, and a copyright? copyright? All right, so usually that that question is very common as well. Um, oftentimes, my, my clients will say, "Can I can I uh, copyright my, my logo or can I can I trademark my book?" So the, well, the main difference actually is a trademark is any visible mark. Mm. So that's that's the, basically the, all the logos that you that you use in your business or in your product. But copyrights are are artistic and literary works. Examples of which are your books, books. music, uh, videos, paintings, um, designs of your chair. Those are copyrightable materials. But they can also be, if you put a logo on the chair, like Kenneth Kobonpe, if you put the name of, the, of Kenneth in there, that's a trademark. But the chair alone is patentable and copyrightable. For example, yes. now, uh, in uh, are songs a copyright? Yes, they are all bound for copyright. That's why you always see um, a disclaimer at the, at the end of the yes. credits to the owner yes. or a link to where he got it, a source. Because you, all vloggers or bloggers are usually bound to 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 mis, to have a mistake on copying. Are there any like um, no, they, there's a process for that. So the the main author or the main owner should contact, uh, should have a lawyer, and then file for a case, and then contact the. Uh, sometimes they they just talk uh, for a fee, perhaps, or or they can or the vlogger can maybe um, cite the the real source or the original maker of it. Well, you have just mentioned earlier that not everything can be uh, registered for a trademark, pero. When it comes to copyright, man, ma'am, um, is everything copyrightable? Yes, so basically that's the difference. Everything, all, all your creations of the mind, can be copyrighted because it, basically it's mm -hmm. yours. It's it's yours, but you 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 will deposit it in our office and the National Library of the Philippines in order for you to have a proof that it's yours. And um, attached to your application is an affidavit of ownership, meaning if it is. If it's not yours, you are also legally bound mm. to the the law. I have a brother in architecture. For example, when he's designing a building, is that uh, copyrightable? Yes, the design of the building, the blueprint is copyrightable, but the building itself may be a, a part of the building can be uh, registered in patent or patent design. It's called industrial design. So it, all the parts of the building can be patented and copyrighted. The blueprints are, are copyrighted. I know all of our viewers learned a lot from today's episode. 
Pero guys, before we finally say goodbye, may again, pero yeah. makagaling na hugot. Pati yes! sige, yo, time to time. Inang, abit mo bala palang gayaman ka, pero nagpaagaw pa sa sa iba. Bala ko lang tanigin, pakatpiray ko man sa para legal na na ako sa. Masakit. <laughs> Okay, okay, na end. Let's go. Let's go. If you have any questions and clarifications, please don't hesitate to comment down below. And that's it for today's episode. Please don't forget to hit like and subscribe down to our channel. We'll see you on our next episode. Bye. Bye.